this story is about how the fire came to Torres Strait long ago when the animals were closely related to humans and they could freely take human form they, they were lizards and snakes living on the island called Nelgi and their leader was called Walek a free neck lizard the lizards would cook their food on hot stones and they often wished that they could cook in a different way so the lizards asked Walek if he could go and get the fire and Walek said yes I will go and if you see a smoke coming up on the northern islands you will know that I am coming back with the fire so Walek jumped in the water and started swimming and he reached Mawa and he changed into human form and then he went to Masingara where he met up with his sister called Ubu and he watched how Ubu cooked her food she cooked her food on the fire and then he looked at her fingers on the right hand and he saw the burning coals in between her fingers were still burning so the next day he asked Ubu to give him fire and she got the fire from the fireplace and as soon as he ran down and he was out of sight the fire went out so he came back and asked his sister to scrape palms with her to say goodbye and as he did that he snatched the coal out of in between her fingers and ran down the beach and as he ran she screamed after him come back Walek that fire belongs to my daughter Surka come back but Walek jumped in the water and swam away he got to Saibai and he ran up uh, on the beach at Saibai and set fire to the grass and then he swam to the other islands he swam to Gitalai, Sauras and Nagi and set fire on those islands now the lizards at Nelgi saw the smoke to the north and they all said Walek is coming back when Walek reached Nelgi he threw the coal to his brothers then he ran to the white ants nest and he opened his mouth and the brothers saw that he had a scar on his tongue so they got him some medicine and then they took the fire in the baler shells and took it around to all the islands in Torres Strait and so every island started to cook with fire but Walek's tongue healed but the scar remained and it never faded so if you go up to the western Torres Strait and look at the top of the white hand's nest you will see the Walek sunning himself and when he opens his mouth you will see the scar on his tongue